lemongrass barley water can strengthen the spleen, wet the appetite, relieve heat and remove dampness. Welcome back! Nice to see you and it is my pleasure to have you here. Today's recipe is to boil lemongrass barley soup. Hope you like it. Welcome to subscribe my channel and save this recipe so you may refer back when you need this recipe. Ingredients Barley Pandan leaves Lemongrass Wash and remove outer layer of lemongrass. Citronella is a common herb, known as lemongrass or lemongrass because of its overall lemon scent. Pandan leaves wash and tie a knot. The scent of pandan is strong and the milky flavor is relatively light. It generally gives people a refreshing feeling, and it is non-toxic, so you can safely grow it at home. Flatten lemongrass to ease of release flavor. Barley wash and set aside. Add water into soup pot. Add all ingredients into soup pot. Cover the lid and let it cook until barley turns soften. I used instant pot barley is soften after cooking for just 30 minutes. Add honeycomb rock sugar to taste. Let's serve it while hot. Barley water with lemongrass and honey is very fragrant and delicious. Drinking a cup will warm your stomach and make you feel comfortable. Because of its name and shape, foreign barley can easily be confused with the traditional Chinese medicine koi seed, so be sure to distinguish them clearly when purchasing or using them. Raw barley. It is gray in color, shaped like red beans, hard in texture, and has black straight stripes on the surface. Cooked barley. After frying, the cooked barley is more than twice the size of raw barley. It is off-white in color and has a loose texture, a bit like popped rice. It also has black straight lines on it. Barley. The shape is smaller than raw barley, shaped like white rice grains, and brown in color. Raw barley. It will sink to the bottom if placed in water. Cooked barley. It will float when placed in water. Barley benefits. Use raw barley to remove dampness. Raw barley has a stronger dehumidifying effect than cooked barley, while foreign barley does not have any dehumidifying effect. Raw barley, it is slightly cold in nature, and its functions are diuresis, dampness removal, heat clearing, and pus removal. Suitable people, 
suitable for strong people who suffer from edema and difficulty urinating, or for strong people who suffer from soreness in their limbs after falling heavily. Cooked barley after frying, it can reduce its cold nature and has the effect of strengthening the spleen. It can also treat diarrhea caused by spleen deficiency and dampness. However, the replenishing effect of cooked barley is weak. If you want to strengthen the spleen, you can use other traditional Chinese medicines such as Attractylodes and Huaishin instead. Suitable people suitable for patients with loose stools or even diarrhea due to spleen deficiency and dampness accumulation. However, it is often combined with other traditional Chinese medicines that strengthen the spleen and dry dampness. It is rare to use cooked barley alone to stop diarrhea. Don't drink barley water indiscriminately. Koi seed is cold and diuretic in nature, so people with poor spleen and stomach function should not use it. People with clinical edema and body swelling think that drinking barley water can be a diuretic and reduce swelling, but in fact it may only be effective temporarily in the initial stage, and it may seem to have an edema-relieving effect by increasing urinary excretion. If you drink barley water for a long time, you may suffer from excessive diuresis and excessive use of cold and cold, which may cause damage to key, making it easier for water to accumulate and increasing the chance of edema. In addition, you may also experience symptoms of key deficiency such as fatigue, sensitivity to cold, etc. There are three thousands of delicious recipes on my YouTube, check it out for more delicious recipes ya. Yeah. I will upload bilingual video recipes every day. Chinese video will be uploaded at noon while English version at 8.30 pm. Welcome to follow and save recipes you like. Remember to follow my channel so you will be able to find me when you need cooking inspiration. By the way, if you are looking for healthy low-carbohydrate recipes, welcome to check out my healthy recipe playlist where there are 388 recipes waiting for you ya. Yeah. I share delicious recipes every day so don't miss it. Thanks for watching. See you in next video ya. Yeah.